guys, this is another video, but this is about bag making. I'm not gonna do a tutorial, I'm just showing you what I have made, bag making project. So I I have this pattern. All the patterns that I've printed right now, I organize them instead of like putting them in whatever. So I'm pretty much organized this time. So I have purchased this from Amazon, printed all my patterns, and then cut the designs and then yeah so i got this this is a free pattern from swan sewing patterns dolly mini crossbody so what i did is just i printed the patterns and blow it up 120 percent because i don't like small i don't like this small it's very small i don't really like small really small bags like something that i can put stuff but not really so i I changed it to 120% photocopy it and made it my own and this is just um, not perfect I made a lot of mistakes this is but this is what I have so for some reason I am not sure I'm not sure that this will hold everything that's why I added rivets but it looks like there's two eyes, so I added another one. They're not the same color because I ran out of rivets. <laughs> so right now it's two tone. <laughs> but this is vinyl. This one is vinyl too. I got this from Hobby Lobby. Both of them are all vinyl. And I actually don't did not plan on putting this logo that I have there. I I plan on putting it up here, but I forgot. And I can't do it anymore because I already sold this to the lining. I should have done that before putting, connecting or sewing the lining. So it was too late. But I can still put this here. So I did. I should have, what I should have done is just put it at the back. But um, I only realized that after looking at all the, the, the other bags, other designs. And some people like, if the design is like this, they put their tags at the back and i should have done that like that instead of putting the tags at the bottom but you know this is not for sale this is for my own personal use so i can just do whatever i want right made a lot of mistakes i i wasn't really good in sewing the bottom part the gazette part for some reason but i've learned here's the back packet i use yellow I just like light colored fabrics for the lining so I can see what's inside and it's really nice except for my sewing my stitching down here I wanted to do this again um, someday with another kind of material but look at that stitching guys my stop my stop my top stitching is also fine I'll just use fleece um, did never use foam because fleece they are required it's a snap closure and here's the fabric it's yellow maybe I should use yellow next time here's the inside there's a slip pocket there I actually added that I it wasn't part of the instruction so I added that there I added also this zippered packet here not part of the instruction so i added that and yeah i can actually put stuff there a lot of stuff let's see mud podge yeah this one what else can i put my no i can't really put that well i don't know Consider this as a wallet. Charlie. No, Charlie. So, no. Charlie. Sorry. So, yeah. Oops. You can put that. Plenty of room. Remember, this is 120% um, of the original design pattern. So, the original is really um, small. So I can put the mask there and close it. Ta-da! So nice. So 
Ah, it fits everything. My glass. So, consider this as a wallet if you have a small wallet. I really like it. I'm going to make more another kind of like after learning from the mistakes that I have here on this first try. I like the combination as well. And I tried, this is my first try. Um, the invisible tab thing. I should have pushed down it is more. And, uh, and I watched the other designer doing this kind of thing and I liked her ways of doing it. It's cleaner. But that one is fine. So, and I intended to have like a half an inch kind of um wide, wide um strap because crossbody I think the half an inch is better looking with this crossbody but yeah I don't know what I'm saying but yeah this is my recent finished crossbody mini dolly if yours if you like sewing like me um this is a free pattern by Swan patterns I'm actually Printing a lot of free patterns. I buy patterns too, but I like to try the free patterns as well. And yeah, this is it. Um, it's really nice. I want to try fabric, um, vinyl and fabric combination as well with this design. So that's all my bag, bag finishes at the back. You can put your phone here. Another... I'm just grabbing whatever I have here, so phone or notebook. I don't know what else can you put in there. Oh, let's see. Let's see this. Nice, right? So that's it. I am actually planning on making another one, but this one is a big one backpack convertible. So it's uh I've already cut the patterns. I have to gather the materials and cut them and I'm so excited about it. But I have to do that once everything is clean here and organized. And but then I focused on designing the full finishing for this. Stay tuned for that. If you want to see them, um wait for my next video. I um and thank you so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. And um, I'll see you next time. Bye.